que j'adore est amoureux L'homme que j'adore est amoureux Do you have a child that's interested in the arts and loves to perform? The Norman Arts Council is hosting a summer art camp with the University of Oklahoma's Fine Arts Department to help introduce children to the arts. There will be workshops on theater production as well as classical music. Students who attend the event will also perform a small recital at the end of the week. Please, visit our website for more information. For children growing up in America, learning to ride a bicycle is a rite of passage. It opens up to them new freedoms and new experiences while giving them a fun form of exercise. Unfortunately, not every child has that experience. 
Lose the Training Wheels is a program working to fix that. The mission of Lose the Training Wheels is to teach individuals with disabilities how to ride conventional bicycles and become lifelong independent riders. They send a floor supervisor and a bike tech with a fleet of specialized bikes across America to run week-long bike camps. In order for a rider to be a participant in a Lose the Training Wheels bicycle camp, they have to be at least eight years old. They have to have a disability. They cannot weigh more than 220 pounds, and they have to be uh, able to walk independently without any type of support. Bike camp starts on Monday. Riders are fitted for helmets and proper bicycle fit before they begin riding. They use specialized training bikes provided by the organization. The first day is easily the most challenging day for the riders. They are confronted with so much new information. Bike riding is a new experience that they may not be comfortable with. They must adjust to working with new people who are not their parents. These things can be a little overwhelming at first. The first day is also quite a challenging day for the volunteers as they learn right alongside the riders. On Tuesday, the bike tech rides a custom tandem with riders, evaluating their progress. Uh, I look for a lot of different things, uh, whether or not they're pedaling, how they're steering, um, what their balance is like, what they're doing with their body as far as if they're shifting their shoulders and their hips or anything like that. Wednesday is launch day. It is the earliest riders get on a conventional two-wheel bike. By Thursday, riders begin the transition to their personal bicycles. On Friday, parents and family are trained to assist in the riding experience. They learn how to best support their riders' new habits. Each rider is allowed to move at their own pace. The volunteers work with the rider so that the rider can make progress and not feel rushed. The bike camp can only succeed with the volunteer support. We need volunteers who are physically fit and able to work with riders. The work is physically challenging for volunteers, but rewards are tremendous. You don't have to have a background with children or adults with disabilities, just a willing heart and a willingness to learn. The very best part of the week is the smiles on the riders' faces. Come, help us change the world one child at a time. For more information on how to volunteer, host a camp, or donate money, please visit these websites.